ChatGPT task is just another reminder app, think again. While most people are using it for basic notifications, I'm going to show you two advanced automations that can help business owners streamline their content and email marketing. Now, these aren't your typical set a reminder tasks. I'm talking about automatically generating Instagram content and crafting professional email newsletters that work while you sleep. And the best part, you can set this up in less than 10 minutes. I'll give you all the prompts, show you exactly how to implement them and show you how to create a system that works 24 seven. No technical skills needed, just follow along. By the end of this video, you'll have a complete automation system that you can start using immediately. And I'm showing you everything step by step. Before we begin, let me show you where to find this feature. Now, if you are a paid subscriber, you will notice in your top left, a GPT-40 with scheduled tasks option. Now, as you can see, this is still in beta. And once you select this, you are ready to go. Firstly, let me show you a few quick examples of how most people are actually using tasks. So I created this task to send me motivational tips to get in shape. So I simply asked it, I want to get in shape, send me motivational messages every morning at 6 a.m. to eat well and exercise. Make them witty, attention grabbing and emotionally driven. And as you can see, my task was created. And daily at 6 a.m., I get motivational messages just like this sent to my inbox. Here's another example. I want you to plan out things for me to do in Durban on weekends. Check the weather and based on that, give me recommendations for things to do with my family. Do this every Thursday at 8 p.m. And just like that, my task was created. And every Thursday, I get recommendations for family activities based on the weather in Durban. These are just basic examples. Now, let me show you two advanced automations that can transform your business. So let's start with an Instagram content automation. We are going to start off with a simple task. And then I'm going to show you how to edit this and make this automation so much more powerful. So my first prompt is every day at 9 a.m. Search the web, find the latest generative AI news and fully script out a new Instagram reel for me. Include a hook that's attention grabbing, captivating and scroll stopping. Write the entire script written at an 8th grade reading level. The script should be between 1000 and 2000 words. Now, as you can see, it automatically generated this for me. But then to tweak this and make this even more powerful, I simply asked it to give me a sample. So this allows you to test out your automation and make any tweaks where necessary. So ChatGPT says, sure, here's a short example of how the script might start. And then it gives me my hook like I requested. It gives me the main content and it gives me the call to action. Now remember, this is going to search the web and find the latest news for us. Now I want to make this custom to me. So what I am asking it now is use Muhammad Asmal style and write the script. So what this is going to do is it is going to allow it to crawl the web and search for content created by me. But don't worry if you don't have your own content online. You could use anybody's style. For example, you could ask it to write the script in the style of Gary V or Frank Kern or Billy Jean or Alex Hormozzi or anyone that you like. And then ChatGPT says, got it. I'll use Muhammad Asmal style for the script. But here again, I want to make sure that it is actually using my own style. So I'm asking it again to show me a sample. And then it says, certainly, here's a sample script written in a concise, straightforward style that draws on Muhammad Asmal's known approach. And then it gives me a hook, main content, clear, relatable examples, key takeaways, and a call to action. 
And then it says, this keeps the message clear and to the point, focusing on how generative AI can be practically useful while maintaining a natural conversational tone. Now, I asked it to explain Muhammad's style. And I'll show you what I'm going to do with this shortly. So here again, I'm just making sure that it understands my style. And it says Muhammad's style often leans on clear, direct communication presented in a structured and easily digestible manner. He tends to focus on breaking complex ideas into manageable, relatable parts, making them accessible to a wider audience. Some key elements of this approach include, and then it goes brevity and clarity, relatable examples, action-oriented takeaways, conversational tone. In short, Muhammad Asmal's style combines simplicity, clarity and practicality to make technical or complicated topics approachable and actionable. Now what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to copy all of this and then head over to the task and click on edit. And now, as you will see, I can edit this task even further. I can add in a name. I can add in my own custom instructions. And I can even change out the schedule if I like. Now, as you'll see, the instructions section is a rather small. So you cannot see this full prompt. So all I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy all of this, then head over to a Google Doc and then paste all of this in here. So now this makes it easy for you to see the full prompt. So I'm simply saying, search for the latest generative AI news and fully script out a new Instagram reel using Muhammad Asmal style. Include a hook that's attention grabbing, captivating and scroll stopping. And then I'm pasting in my style. So this is just to make sure that it understands my style. Now let's see the results. So as you can see in this example, it uh, searched the web, it found generative AI news, and it wrote the Instagram real script for me. It gave me a hook. It added in the main content. It even added in the sources. And it ended with a call to action. And if I click on this, I can actually view the sources that it used. And as you can see, I've done this for a few days. And what you can also do is, if you find something is not working, you can always go back to your task and edit the instructions and refine it and this will allow you to refine your output to exactly the way that you want it. Now, what makes this powerful is we're not just creating content. We are creating content in our own style and our own brand voice. And we are also creating current up-to-date content. Now, how are these tasks automatically delivered to you? So you will receive an email from OpenAI that will show you a brief overview about the task. And then to read the complete message, you will have to click on view message, which will take you to ChatGPT to view the results. And if you want to find where all your tasks live, simply click on your profile name on the top right hand corner and then click on tasks. This will show you all your tasks and you can even edit them from here as well. Now, remember, you are limited to running 10 tasks at one time. Now for the second advanced task, which is the newsletter system. This is powerful because it will research current industry news and trends, write engaging newsletters and format it all professionally. So here's how to do it. So I started off simply saying every Thursday at 6 p.m. search the web and give me the latest AI news. Craft an email with this info that will go out weekly to my email list. So I'm starting off with simple instructions. Now you may have noticed that in my initial prompt, I'm saying 6 p.m. But if you look at the task, it now says daily at 2.15 a.m. That is because I have edited these tasks. So I continuously monitor them and edit and tweak them where necessary. So after it created my task, I wanted to test it out. So I simply asked it to search the web and give me a sample. Now, just asking it for a sample will make your life so much easier because you will be able to test its output instantly. So here's what it came up with. It gave me the date. It gave me the newsletter, the industry developments, and it gave me a conclusion as well. And together with that, it added in the sources as well. But what I did to make this even more powerful is I simply went to edit this task and then I gave it these advanced instructions. 
So again, what I'm going to do here is I'm simply going to copy all of this, then head over to a blank Google Doc and paste this in so that you can see this complete prompt. Now you will notice that this is a much more detailed prompt. And this is the secret to getting the most out of ChatGPT tasks. You need to create a detailed instructions that tell it exactly what you want and how you want it done. Now let's go over the instruction. So I'm simply saying use Muhammad Asmal's writing style and then I pasted in the same style that we got from the previous task. And then I'm saying create an attention grabbing email that uses an intriguing Frank Kern style subject line that creates curiosity. Opening hook that makes readers want to keep reading, conversational straight talk style, strategic use of parenthetical asides like this for emphasis, pattern interrupts to maintain engagement, story driven elements that lead to the news. And then I said, search the web and become a market researcher for the most significant generative AI developments from the past seven days, focusing specifically on and then I'm going into detail, new generative AI marketing tools and capabilities, innovations, AI developments, notable AI marketing case studies. And then I'm saying find at least two to three reliable sources. And I'm even asking it to crawl YouTube or Twitter. And then I'm giving it the structure that I want the email in. And then I'm saying for each development, share a quick win, show the practical marketing benefit. And then I'm adding in the length as well as the target audience. Now I will leave this entire prompt in the description of this video. But can you see how detailed I am being? And here is the result. So as you can see, it searched for AI news and then it gave me a subject, unlocking new marketing opportunities with AI innovations. And then it gives me the body and then it's showing me some industry examples and giving me the latest news and giving me an application and then it closes off the email and here you can see the sources as well of where it gathered this news. Now before we wrap up, I want to share some important tips. Remember, this is not just copy and paste. This is just doing 90% of the work for you, but you still need to add your own 10%. So you will need to proofread it, make sure that this is relatable for your audience and try and add in your own personal touch. Because even if this is using your own style, going over it and making sure that it's exactly how you want it to be is critical. Because remember, you don't just want to create mass content. You want your content to be quality as well. So there you have it. Two powerful automation tasks that can streamline your content creation and marketing. Let me know which automation tasks you are going to test out first. Now I know some of you are struggling to get consistent results with AI prompts. Trust me, I've been there. That's why I created the ultimate AI prompt guide that will allow you to take your prompts from good to great. You will find a link to it in the description of this video. So until the next time, hit the like button if you found this video useful and click on the next video that YouTube recommends for you. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. So I'll see you in the next video.